This is a follow up to the black screen blinking red light video I did back in January 19, 2016. I try to respond to every comment that comes in, I really do, but it's beginning to get a bit repetitive on my end so I decided an updated video is easier to refer people to in the future. Today we'll be going over all the little techniques I picked up over the past few months dealing with this issue. I call it black screen blinking red light. If you're an iPhone user, click this annotation on the screen. If not, sit your ass down and listen. Let's get started. You plugged your mom's phone into the charger yesterday and woke up to this. A lifeless phone with a pulse. That's it. How do I fix this, you may be wondering. You talk too much, a viewer once said. <laughs> I know, I know. So let's get to a point. The first thing I recommend you do is plug this sap sucker into a charger you know for sure works. Next, hold down the home, power, and volume up button simultaneously just until the device powers on. If your phone does indeed power on, release the power button while still holding the home and volume up button. I recommend wiping the partition catch for extra measures. What this does is flushes out any corrupted files you might have downloaded preventing the phone from properly booting up. Once you get to this screen, use the volume rockers to navigate your way through the options until you get to wipe partition catch. Hit the power button to select, it'll say wiping catch, formatting catch, catch wipe complete. To boot up the phone, navigate to reboot system now and hit the power button. Method 2 requires a little less work on your end. Hold down the power button for roughly 10 seconds. If your phone powers on, great. If not, just hold on, we'll turn it on. <laughs> Keep holding it until you reach the 15 second mark. Only then can you plug a charger to it while still holding down the power button. It should power on by now. These methods should work the same way on phones without physical home buttons. If the two methods did you no justice, then you better hope this one does because I'm beginning to run out of arsenal. Last but not least, remove the battery. If it is non-removable, find a way to remove it. Your phone depends on it. Thank you for watching. Let me in on the backstory of how your phone got the way it did down in the comments below. Anyways, guys, Benji D here from Get Fixed, and I'm out. Peace.